Sarah, will you explain about treatment and prevention of lung cancer to our viewers? My pleasure, Ethan. Treatment for lung cancer. First one is surgery. If cancer is at initial stage, as stage 1 or sometimes stage 2, surgery is commonly administered. In another case, if the cancer has not spread beyond the lung, surgery may be applied. Surgeons may remove a portion of lung, lobe, or sometimes the whole lung. Next is radiation therapy. In radiation therapy high energy radiation is directed to kill cancer cells. Radiation therapy may be delivered, either, with the help of a machine, that directs radiation toward the cancer, or internally by placing a radioactive matter in sealed containers, at the location of tumor. Next is, chemotherapy. In chemotherapy, drugs are administered, to stop the growth of cancer cells. Drugs can do this by killing cancer cells or preventing them from dividing. Sometimes chemotherapy is applied alone, and sometimes, as an adjuvant to surgical therapy. It may also be applied in combination with radiotherapy. Side effects of chemotherapy are fatigue, weight loss, hair loss, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, and mouth sores. Next is, targeted drug therapy. There are newer cancer treatments as targeted therapies, that work by targeting specific abnormalities in cancer cells. Targeted therapy is generally used in combination with chemotherapy. Trastuzumab, or Herceptin, there is a protein, called human epidermal growth factor receptor 2 positive, or in short HER2 positive, which promotes the growth of cancer cells. Herceptin targets this protein, and by doing so, it reduces the growth of tumor. There may be some side effects, as, headaches, and heart damage. Lipatinib, or Ticurb, sometimes, Herceptin does not suit to some patients. In that case, Ticurb is used to target the HER2 protein. There may be some side effects, as, painful hands, painful feet, skin rashes, mouth sores, extreme tiredness, diarrhea, vomiting, and nausea. Bevacizumab, or Avastin. Tumor get the nutrients and oxygen from blood vessels. If the contact between tumor and blood vessel is terminated, the tumor will not get nutrient and oxygen. It will cause tumor to starve. There may be some side effects, as congestive heart failure, hypertension or high blood pressure, kidney damage, heart damage, blood clots, headaches, mouth sores. Thanks viewers for watching this video. If you like this video, Please share with your friends. If you have any query, please write down in comment box. You may subscribe this channel for more upcoming videos.